to short circuit a servo mechanism. Maybe not, but I can still run. <laughs> Wham! Bang! Warpath's on the roll! <laughs> I just changed heads last week. Let's grab a jet stream and get out of here. Wait a minute. There's energy. Energy? energy. Yeah. It's coming from these stones. Follow Ravage. My sensors indicate the energy stronger inside. Bam! Gotcha! Who's back? This joint, anyway. Our tomb. Not quite, Starscream. Your senses were right. There is energy in here. Out of the way, Rumble. It could be dangerous. As your leader, I must take the risk. Anyway, I'm lower on energy than you. Come on, Hoist. You take any longer and bam, I'm here. Stop hogging it all for yourself. Look, it is not blocked anymore. And the Autobots are gone. They just hope there's some energy here somewhere for the guys who didn't get to charge up inside. Giant armored knights from the Dragon Mound? Starscream! Robots ahead! Could be trouble. You better believe it. There's some kind of weird-looking Autobots. And they're attacking me! A spy from the Red Knight! Charge! Egads! Giants! We're doomed! <laughs> Inferior construction, even for an Autobot! One good whack, it breaks right in two! Not Autobots, but humans pretending to be robots! So Wagon to Blackthorn pretends to nothing! Who art thou? I am Star! Scream of Cybertron! What would I not give to see these fellows arrayed against Sir Aethling the Red? You could probably use the help. Interesting technology, but not very modern. What means thou? It was made this year. What year is that? 543 Anno Domini. Then that stone room must have been a time transporter. Human, it suits my purpose to help you defeat your enemy. The Red something or other. Oh, those magical knights against my father. I must warn him. <laughs> what is it, Ravage? A spy after him. Stay! Let Ravage get the spy. What's more important is that we have 1,451 years to go before we have to worry about the Autobots and that bungler Megatron. Hey, what's the matter? You're all right now. Come, we must get away from here before the dragon returns. She must mean Starscream. My dear girl, I find it hard to believe that my data bank dates your costume to 542 AD. You mean? Fashion is always a year behind Camelot out here in the countryside. Camelot? My name's Nimue. Uh, I'm Spike. Wilt thou help us against the other giant knights? We'd like nothing better. Lean on. Father will be so pleased. Sir Aitling, if your daughter thinks the Decepticons are aiding Sir Wigand of Blackthorn, you're going to need help. Hoist, I need some help too. Well, Nimue says I need armor to be in the tournament tomorrow. Oh, oh, oh. I'll do what I can. 
Mr. Aithley, why are you and Sir Wigan feuding? Cows, Sir Hoist. They wandered through a break in his fence and devoured my garden. I told the young hothead I'd keep them until he fixed the fence, whereupon he accused me of stealing and claimed my land's really his. The tournament is simply an excuse to get him here to settle things peacefully. I hope. My word, that is incredible. I just hope it fits. Hoist, what's wrong? Oh, getting low on energy. Oh. oh, well, how do I look? <laughs> Just wonderful, Sir Spike. Take this. Thou shalt be my champion on the field of honor. Hmm. Tomorrow's going to be a big day. Exciting. I just hope I can make Sir Wigan see reason. Okay, kiddo. Now aim for the center of the guy's shield and clang! Hang on to your horse! I'll do my best. That's your call. <laughs> Sir Spike, my champion! At least I hung on to my horse. Sir Wagon, I bid thee welcome. And I bid thee hold thy tongue, unless thou art willing to settle our dispute in battle. I'd hoped for peace, but if that's thy will, so be it. It is, with the winner declared rightful lord over this entire countryside. So be it. I'll meet thee at arms. Correction. Thou shalt meet my champions. Sir Rumble and Sir Ramjet. E hoist, old buddy! I think it's time we bam join the party! What you waiting for, Red Knight? Don't you wanna rumble with Rumble? No laser power left, but we're still gonna whoosh clean their clocks. <laughs> no, it's impossible. The Autobots can't have followed us here. This is my world to conquer. Mine! Tail. Ooh, ooh. 
Kidnap the fair Nimui? <laughs> Make some idiot 20 feet tall, and he thinks he rules the earth. Thou who playest with fire might find himself singed by the dragon's breath. Just wait till my father gets here. What's the meaning of this? Kidnapping Nimue was stupid enough, but keeping a prisoner in my castle... I give the orders now, and this is my castle, as it will soon be... <laughs> my world! Starscream, if we don't find some energy to steal pretty soon... <coughs> Lord Starscream, here's the gold jewelry as demanded. Wolf, what art thou doing? Those belong to my grandmother. I was going to give them to... Your new lord, Starscream. Why, thank you, because I need them to make wire for my new electric dynamo. There's hardly enough to charge my basic life support systems. Faster, you malingering peasants! It's all my fault, Warpath. I was Nimui's champion, and I should have protected her. I feel kind of guilty about it myself. Warpath, come on. We need your help. I gotta go see what Sir Hoist wants. But if you wanna, go on ahead and see what you can do. Just leave some Decepticons for the rest of us. Starscream, aren't you finished yet? Okay, okay, I'm done. The charcoal's coming along fine. You can go for the rock salt now. Rumble! Ravage! Get out of there! You're going with Sir Wolf for sulfur! We need potassium nitrate, too. Don't tell me you're gonna fetch it. No, Rumble. Not I. And me and my big mouth. Goest from here! Nimue, I want to... I care not! Thou hast done enough already! First thou tries to steal my father's castle, and now these monsters thou calls friends are going to make slaves of us all, and... Thou art right. And then... What? Thou art absolutely right. I've been an idiot, but I'll do my best to change. Th thou wilt? Yes. By the way, didst thou know thine eyes are most beautiful? They are? I'm here to rescue! But thanks to the ingredients you've gathered, what we do have is... Gunpowder! I only hope the Autobots are stupid enough to attempt to rescue. Like I started to say before... Spike, why should I want to be saved from Sir Wigand when we've just decided to get married? Oh...
tower, how will we scale the walls? You still got us! And so do I, right in my sights! Wolf, thou must help me stop this. Sure, I'll help thee right into the moat. Lord Starscream, just relieve thee of thy command. All right, Wolfie. <coughs> now you've got Sir Spike to deal with. And that will be a pleasure. Actually, the pleasure was all mine. That's it? You've got it? Keep on going. Don't forget about me! Oh, ow! Hey, careful! Warpath, you and I got a score to settle! Energy. Without energy, we're done for. Spike! Look out! Oh, no! The Transformers will return after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. No! Energy. So these are the famous giant knights. And also our friends. And if they don't get this thing they call energy, I fear they'll perish. Leaving Lord Starscream to stand invincible in this primitive world. Not if my magic can help it. Foolish human, magic can never defeat science. Kilwas, god of the sky, I know not of science, but if thou wilt bring the Giants, life! <sighs> you can say that again. I don't know how you did that, but it sure felt good. No, this can't be. Rumble, Ramjet, reactivate the dynamo. Warpath. My lasers still don't work, but I can transform again. Then let's wham! Go get him! It's not much of a ring, but... It's... it's beautiful. Oh, Father, isn't this wonderful? <sighs> Better luck next time, pal. Energy. I need energy. What will you do with them? Take them back with us. <laughs> that is, if there's a way... Uh, hoist said time. Why, these valiant knights, they're time travelers. How come it's called the Dragon Mound? Well, I created it to use as a time traveling device. But then a wandering dragon decided to make it his home. We never saw him. That's because he's been out visiting relatives. But he's home now. I refuse to go any closer. Don't worry, I've got a full dose of Dragon's Bane. It works every time. He's crazy! We can't trust our lives to unscientific superstition! Why not? Bayor's magic's done pretty well by us so far! There's no reason it shouldn't work. 
I used all the normal ingredients. Sulfur, rock salt, seagull droppings, charcoal. <laughs> Scrub the temple floor with your tongues! Behold the Sky God! Look ye on his might and despair! He demands your harvest offerings! this an offering? Please, my family starves. The Sky Gods will show no mercy. Follow me! Jero, oh. your Sky Gods are an excuse for high taxes and harsh laws. You will be punished for your blasphemy, Talaria. Try your superstitious drivel elsewhere, Jaro. I believe in reason and common sense. There are no sky gods. Yow! Cosmos to Autobot base! Come in, Optimus Prime! I got energy data on my tapes and Astro Train on my tail! The Decepticons will do anything to gain access to that information. Cosmos, beam us the data. Too dangerous, Prime. Don't, Cosmos, if the Decepticons intercept it. Read your red alert. I'll deliver my message in person. Astro Train, you're running out of energy. Silence thrust. I'm, I'm in complete, complete control. control. Complete control. Oh, ionic blast. Cosmos, come in. I'm 
the astrologer priests use false gods to enslave and rob you. No, the sky gods are real. They reward us for our sacrifices. How? By keeping us in a land where food is scarce and children starve? The sky gods forbid us to move to another land. That's why the chasms were formed. They forbid? Or you forbid, Jero? Show me a sky god, so I may ask him. It appears the sky gods have deigned to answer your challenge, Talaria. exist. Get up. This is one of Jero's tricks. These fools worship Transformers. If I claim to be their supreme god, they will bow to the Decepticons. Why should you be the supreme god? I'm a much better choice. Quiet, Starscream. I've got a coronation to attend. Bow down! Worship the true gods! You'll need more than this to convince me. I am Astro Train, mightiest of all the gods! Fall down and worship your new master, Worms! From this day forward, all who defy me, die! Prop up that hunk of junk there. Why do we do all the work? Because Astro Train will vaporize us if we don't. What is the god Astro Train doing? Silence, fool! Isn't it obvious? He's making an idol to worship. Here is Cosmo's precious energy data. And here is what immobilized him. <laughs> what a pity, Cosmos. Reconnect one little wire and you could call for help. Speaking of help, you burned up most of your energy chasing Cosmos. Better call Megatron. No! I am in control here. Then we're stuck on this mud ball! Only until I break Cosmos' code. What happened? We've been trying to reach you for hours. The... the one you call Cosmos is hurt. Quickly, what planet are you on? Planet? I don't know the word. Never mind. You should see a glowing red light. Touch it and you'll send a signal beacon. We'll do the rest. Uh. That's, That's Cosmos' signal beacon. She has met the Autobots here, but they will not find her alive. The Transformers will return after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. somewhere we wouldn't hear of it De decepticons cosmos is reactivated coward his damages <laughs> rendered him harmless <laughs> Titan, energy output 90%. 
97%. Once there, transformation impossible. That's why two Autobots will ride with you. To rescue Cosmos and find energy for you. I will be one of them and... Hold it, Optimus. We can't risk losing you. That's where we come in. I am the only one capable of deciphering Cosmos's data. And me, I just like kicking Decepticon cans. Talk excessive. Time limited. Let's hope it's not just a one-way trip. Mighty Astro Train, the Fire God's lair I told you of. Look at this! I've never seen crystals so rich in energy! A perfect power source for Decepticons! This must be what Cosmos discovered! Gerald, the crystals are taboo. The ancient tablets say... Taboo? To a god? Lord Astrotrain may do with them as he wishes! What is your energy reserve status, Omega Supreme? Dwindling. You can do it, Omega! Go, baby, go! Crash. Inevitable. Ah! Ah! Wow, you stopped just in time. Indeed. Another meter or so and we'd have perished. We'll pull you back off the edge. No. Strength is insufficient. Cosmos required. We'll find Cosmos and his energy source, then come back for you. Just don't move. Sarcasm not appreciated. Crystals are sacred. Treat them with respect or we all die. He's right. The crystal matrix is extremely unstable. Daryl, see, there are no mistakes. We've been searching for hours. Not the slightest sign of Cosmos. But there is a native in that tree shooting arrows at us. As long as I breathe, Titans will not worship false gods. False gods? To hazard a guess, the Decepticons arrived before we did. Look, if you stop shooting and start talking, maybe we could work something out. There's the temple. Your friend is held prisoner inside. There he is. This is terrible. Cosmos has been in worse predicaments. No, I mean worshipping him like he's some kind of god. We're not gods, we're just fancy machines, Talaria. Faster! Faster! To the temple! <laughs> Mustn't anger your gods, eh? Hey? Autobots! Right you are, and there's something for you. <laughs> Stand and fight, coward! Pretty good odds! Two against two! Face the star scream! This time ain't gonna win! Thrust! Help me! Astro Train! Autobots! 
They're trying to rescue Cosmos! Hit the false gods with your crystals! Oh no! I'm on your side! Slay them! Hey! Use larger crystals! N no! It's dangerous! Obey your god! Jazz! What's transpiring out here? Jazz? Perceptor? No! A heretic. What more fitting end than to be sacrificed? The Transformers will return after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. They may be lurking in ambush. Nonsense! The crystals chase them off for good! Titan is ours! Circle around the volcano and see where they got those crystals. How dare you cease working? They are lazy insects, so oh mighty Astro Train. Shall I punish them? No! Let them see the sacrifice. That will renew their vigor. Look at this. Oh, highly unstable crystallized energy. If the Decepticons rule Titan, they're beating us out of bots. We've got to refuel Omega Supreme. Don't! Set off one crystal, and a chain reaction will blow us all up. Indeed. We worship you, but all you bring is death and sorrow. You have destroyed our faith. Now destroy us. Hang on a minute, Jack. We ain't gods and never claim to be. But Lord Astrotrain lied to you. If we'd listened to Teleria, we wouldn't be in this mess, and she wouldn't be sacrificed. What? Sacrificed? Quick, is there another entrance to the temple? There is the floor of the temple, and there is the pool that leads to the chasm surrounding our plateau. Electric lava. The same substance as the crystals. You take some crystals and refuel Omega Supreme. I'm gonna rescue Delaria.
Thanks to you, we gained a new one. I fixed him. He's working again. <sighs> we have much to be thankful for. Like no Decepticons to monkey around with your beliefs. The Transformers will return after these messages. Geologic analyzer circuits. 
Hans, we were fortunate this time, Megatron. Next time, your wild scheme to tap the Earth's core could destroy us all. But if I succeed, Starscream, and I will, we Decepticons will possess an energy source richer than any in the galaxy. The molten might of this planet itself. It's too dangerous. The Earth is a sphere like this boulder, and it too will shatter, eradicating everything, including us! You underestimate me, Starscream. Come! That's the general idea! What? The rock wall is a hologram! A projected image! Designed to hide this secret from prying optical sensors! A space bridge to Cybertron! It is our emergency escape route! Then if the drill does shatter the Earth... So be it! We will be safe, each and every last one of us! <laughs> What's with the mud massage? Chill out, Gears. It'll do wonders for all the foam in your complexion. Hold on! There's supposed to be a river here. Are you sure about that, Sunstreaker? I could hardly be mistaken about anything as big and wet as a river. Let's backtrack. There! What did I tell you? It's a river, all right. But it's been diverted into that canyon. And look who's enjoying the view. Construct the guns! Okay, scavenger, your geologic analyzer circuits are better now than the day you were assembled. Let's transform and return to base. Okay, Autobots, move out! Constructicons go to nowhere city. Attention, Megatron. Aerial reconnaissance report from Laser Beak. The river's been diverted into that canyon. Autobots! And look who's enjoying the view. Constructicons! You iridium plated idiots! You were spotted by an Autobot patrol! All constructed cars to the surface at once! Those Autobots must be annihilated before they can transmit our location! Constructed cars! Transform and merge into. Devastator! <laughs> Headquarters. I may shatter when I hit, but the Decepticons will never find my pieces. Like Keep drilling! We must reach the Earth's core on schedule! Unbelievable! Got to get word of this to headquarters or bye bye, planet Earth! Chaz, dazzle that big freak with a light 
show while we demonstrate a little fancy footwork. Yeah, you got it, Sun Streaker. Teletron 1 confirms our worst fears. The Decepticon drilling operation will shatter the Earth. We've got to stop it. I hate to say this, Optimus, but Devastator tips the odds in Megatron's favor. Maybe Wheeljack and I have an answer for that, Optimus Prime. A Dominator disc to override Devastator's circuits. And bring him under our control. Devastator? Under Autobot control? Sure. We secretly place one of these on each of the Constructicons. When they all join together, zap! Our Dominator discs will make Devastator ours. Probably. We hope. We'll find out tonight, Chip. Assemble a commando raiding party. Turn after these messages. We now return to the Transformers. Perfect vengeance at last! Let them go! What? Traitor! Nonsense! Why destroy a paltry six Autobots when we can eliminate them all forever? They think they're going to gain control of a Devastator, but I have other plans. Yes, tell me, please. In due time, Starscream, our moment of glory is almost at hand. The Autobots attack, we shall be ready.
Look, my digital units are cross chip. Put me down, Devastator, and attack the Decepticons. Yes, Optimus Prime, I obey. a rotten actor you couldn't fool a Saturnian simpleton. I've stored enough water to cool the drill for its final thrust to the Earth's core. I still think it's too dangerous. Severing coward! I've been right about everything so far, haven't I? Y yes and I forgot. If anything goes wrong, we can always escape through the space bridge. You've thought of everything, Megatron. I always do. <laughs> he did it. He welded the perimeter of your micro circuit. Of course I did it. I can perform flawlessly to within one five hundred thousandth of a Cybertronic mini-inch. The Decepticons have somehow resumed drilling. <laughs> Let's move out. We've got to stop that drill now. There's nothing like watching the enemy through Devastator's eyes, eh, Starscream? Battle stations! The Autobots are in for a memorable catastrophe. Transformers. Now, Devastator! Exterminate the lot of them! Earthquake! The drill's nearing the Earth's core! It's 
our only chance out of here. Careful, Wheeljack. If you overload his circuits, it could fry his logic chips. You were right. He's out of control. your nullifier, and they'll try combining frequencies to bring Devastator back under control. Yes, then we'll use him to stop the drill. Don't do it! It's a trick! Devastator! Devastator! Help! I do this only for the benefit of my Decepticons. It grieves me that you may also profit. Mr. Nobility's busy saving his own neck. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong! He withdrew to fight Autobots another day! You haven't heard the last of Megatron! What's the matter, Chip? I guess I was hoping Devastator might join the Autobots for good, but that's probably just a dumb old dream. Hang on to your dreams, Chip. The future is built on dreams. Hang on. The Transformers will return after these messages. <laughs> <laughs> 